Hey everyone, this is Jenny Garcia and in this video I'm going to do a Traveler's Notebook spread using only the color blue and I have a lot of washi, like a ridiculous amount of washi and when I was trying to come up with an idea for an all blue project I remember all the washi that I have and said maybe doing a background with just washi would be really cool so and I decided that after I found this photo of my daughter in her t-ball uniform so all the blues I chose are based on that color of the uh, cups blue and my favorite washi tape is that one with the stars the first one that I use and I wanted to do it randomly and put all kinds of washi tape around the page but I also want to distribute that well so I'm going I'm choosing only one color and then going around and eventually I will go back and add a little more of this and that and I'm gonna use also two washi tapes that are black and white because it was way too much blue and even though I'm gonna cover it up with the tag and the photo I wanted like a little very tiny breathing space and these washies are from Michaels the one with the stars and the polka dots that I'm using right now and the chevron are from Michaels the other two are from eBay from a million years ago but it's a pretty common pattern that you can find in many shops that um, sell washi tape. And that very skinny one is from an Amy Tangerine washi tape set. And I know that it's a little boring to watch, but uh, I tried to. I try trying to cut this part in I don't know it didn't feel like it obviously made sense but I just wanted something like really clear to see how exactly I did it and I didn't want to make it way too fast because I know that that makes some people dizzy and I'm using that one with the inches and the hello one that I'm going to use is a washi tape from Hobby Lobby. And I am using a traveler's notebook from Freckle Fawn. And I'm using the Simple Stories Say Cheese Roller Stamp to stamp a bunch of stars in this tag. And I just want a little texture. I'm not going to fill out the whole thing, especially because the photo is going to go on top. And I was just going to stop there and then I went crazy and I kept adding and adding like I normally do. It's a thing I do. And since the washi is a tricky surface to glue in, I'm going to use the Tombow Extreme Permanent Adhesive to glue that tag in the background but I'm gonna use the mono permanent adhesive to glue the photo and the die cut and that pack of die cuts from, from Amy Tangerine is I believe is better together I'm not really sure it was really hard my Sapler wouldn't reach all the way back so I have to lift it a little bit those two die cuts on the bottom are from Citrus Twist so a project like that is cool if you organize your embellishments by color that way you can put a dent on your stash and I could make a layout like this every day with the washi and still I wouldn't be able to use all the washi that I have those stars are from Pink Fresh Studio and they came in a Citrus Twist embellishment uh, kit. And the little star that I used, the last one, is from a Target sticker. 
and I was looking for something simple to put on that side because I like when I do a traveler's notebook I like to do something busy on one side and then simple on the other one so I was gonna use this card I actually use this card sorry and what I was trying to do was do a pattern inside the letters but didn't look like much so I decided to color the whole thing using the Tombow Twin Tone Dual Tip Markers you know how to color so I'm just gonna cut that a little bit and even with that it felt like a little like it just blended with the page so I'm gonna use that uh, star stamps around it and I'm also gonna use happy place because my daughter really did love table I'm just gonna stamp and ghost a little too and I wanted to go around it I'm gonna leave a space in the bottom to write cups and that card is from the high five um, core kit from Project Life these are really old thickers I think I bought those at TJ Maxx yes and they're a little little bit old so you may not find them anymore but they're really cool and I'm just gonna add a few more embellishments because this is my version of simple on one side if you've seen my videos you know that I over embellish so much but it's part of my process and I love these stars from Pinkfresh Studio and that um, sticker sheet from Target they also had a baseball bat um, baseball ball so that's what I glued there too I was trying to do uh, I tried to do it actually with a white pen and none of my white pens would like work that day so I used the black uh, pen from Tumbo the 03 to just draw lines to add a little bit more of you know texture and I like to staple so a little bit on that corner and this is the whole thing I normally don't use all one color but the, since this was for Tumbo and we were challenged to use only one color I chose blue and I'm, I'm pretty happy with how it looks and I had so much fun making it thank you so much guys for watching I hope you enjoyed this video if you like Traveler's Notebook Spreads give this video a thumbs up and have a day oh god have a nice day <laughs> see you next time bye